Hello friends, welcome to today's Daily Devotion. We are continuing to look at the story of Jesus intersecting into our stories and how Jesus becomes the protagonist as we prepare ourselves for the coming of Christ. Today we are reading out of the Gospel of Luke and we've actually jumped into the story where Jesus has entered into our world. We're reading from Luke chapter 2, reading verses 13 through 15. Hear now these words. Suddenly, a great company of the heavenly host appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to those on whom his favor rests. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let's go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. Of course, this portion of the story out of Luke's gospel has inspired carol after carol after carol. Angels we have heard from high, angels from the realm of glory. Um, oh, I mind is going blank on all the different titles, but the song that I want to focus on today is actually one that is literally based on what the angel's message was, and on earth, peace to those on whom his favor rests, or as the old King James says, peace on earth, goodwill towards men. And that song is, I Heard the Bells on Christmas Day. The lyrics to this were based on a poem by Henry Wordsworth Longfellow. And here is what he opened with. I heard the bells on Christmas Day, their old familiar carols play, and mild and sweet the words repeat of peace on earth, goodwill to man. He said that he literally was inspired to write this as he was listening to the bells in his town ringing on Christmas Day. But the Christmas Day in question was December 1863. Do you remember what was going on in that year? The American Civil War. On that Christmas day, he might have heard bells ringing in his town, but there were also cannons booming, rifles firing, charges being made, and men and boys being killed all across our nation. And so Wordsworth goes on to talk about all of these things. He says, and in despair, I bowed my head. There is no peace on earth, I said, for hate is strong and mocks the song of peace on earth, goodwill to men. It's so easy for us to get caught up in that verse, isn't it? Especially in these crazy days of December 2023, when it seems more true than ever. Hate is strong and mocks the song. There is no peace on earth. We see it all over the world, both at home and abroad. So what are we to make of this situation? Is the song not strong enough? No, it ends with words of hope. Then pealed the bells more loud and deep. God is not dead, nor doth he sleep. The wrong shall fail, the right prevail, with peace on earth, good will to men. My friends, 2,000 years ago, there were those who thought that if they could just kill Jesus, then it would all be done. This idea of peace on earth, goodwill toward men, that God has come to give us his heavenly glory, it's all a fantasy, it's fake, it's nothing. But on the third day, what happened? <laughs> He rose again. 
then pealed the bells more loud and deep. God is not dead, nor does he sleep. Jesus has risen. The wrong will fail. The right prevail. With peace on earth, goodwill towards all on whom his favor rests. Is Jesus with you today? Are you on his side? And I'll see you tomorrow for another daily devotion.